is not ready yet. I have to get out of here. Ah. Uh. I think uh, Cootie's just, he's fun because he, he he's not one dimensional. He has a lot of different qualities that, that keep jumping around. Uh, I think he's someone who's very smart and intelligent and he knows a lot, but he doesn't know it all. Uh, so when he goes outside for the first time, there's a lot of moments that are very new to him. So playing, playing, uh, you know, scenes where everything felt new and everything felt different, that was fun to try to tap into that young spirit and that naive energy. Uh, well, Boots actually emailed me personally uh, with the script and the title of the script said 13 foot tall black man in Oakland. And I think once you read that, you're very intrigued and curious as to what he means. So uh, once I saw that, I, I, we took a meeting a week later and he, he painted the vision for me and he told me how he wanted to execute it. And it just excited me because I knew it would be a challenge and something very important and different. Um, I mean, incredibly relatable. I think, I think Cootie is a lot like all of us, where sometimes we feel different. We feel like we don't fit in. We, we feel like we're not welcomed or, or something about us is, is too weird. Um, but Cootie takes that all with pride and he loves who he is and he loves himself and he's confident that he knows what he needs and, and who he is. And so seeing somebody who is always deemed as different, but believes that he is who he is, I think is just very inspiring. And I relate to that in a lot of ways in my own life. The best part about being in Hollywood right now, the, the weather's nice. Um, <laughs> no, I'm kidding. <laughs> uh, just, I, I think it's really amazing to be part of projects that push the grain and, and, and open up conversations that are different. And I think Hollywood is doing a, a cool job right now at introducing projects that are opening up conversations that we don't ever speak about from different perspectives and different cultures. I, I'm in full support of the Hollywood uh, writer's strike. Uh, I think that there's a lot of change that needs to happen on the back end of projects and a lot of um, fairness that needs to be allowed uh, because writers are the crutch of everything we see and, and there would be no film, no show without there being the script and the dialogue. So um, I'm in full support of, of the movement and, and all the work that needs to be done to allow for change to happen. Sisters, sisters.